Incredible new video of an alleged Seattle home invasion caught on tape. A photojournalist coming home to find two men inside his house. Yeah, but unlike most of us, he didn't turn and run. He turned on his camera and then gave them the third degree. John Berman takes a look. Why are you in my house? I'm probably not going to have an answer you like. It's a homeowner's nightmare. Come home to find strangers inside your house. The place trashed. I look in here. And there's a man in my bedroom. Side profile. Now, you might turn and run, but not Seattle photojournalist Joe Orsillo. What he did, he got out his camera, started rolling, and started asking questions. I'm going to make a news story of you. I want to know why you're inside my house. You had to ruin, you think you had to ruin my house. The house, he says, was littered with drugs, stolen merchandise, and stolen credit cards. The place was in shambles. Food was everywhere. Carpeting was ruined. They had crack cocaine pipes. I understand if you had to sleep here, maybe, but why did you have to do that? Man. Dude, why? Orsillo and his family had been fixing up the home to try to sell it after his mother's death. With his camera rolling, he interrogates one of the alleged intruders. What is it you think you're allowed to come in here and just do this to my house? Do you know how hard I worked on this house? This is my house I grew up in. This is my bedroom. A second man was also in the home, but according to Orsillo, he escaped through a bathroom window before police could get there. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to make an example of you, and you're going to wish you never came into my house because I'm going to tape you. Police arrested the suspect who was caught on camera. The other suspect is still at large. Wow, that's uh, quite the story. Yeah, I mean, most people would turn around and run, but instead he does the exact opposite. And, and the suspect stayed there and talked to him, which I know, is I don't, crazier. I, and to be honest, I don't think I'd be brave enough to do that. No. At all. I just want him out.